Shalom, brothers and sisters. Hola. Aloha. It's 3.37 in the morning. Bringing this nice lecture. Child support volunteers. Let's get to it. Go to this page and check on Nebraska, what it's all about. Uh, look at this. Nebraska Child Support Payment Center. And tell me why is it that it's a part of the Treasury Division. Huh? Don't it look like you take some money? Give me all your money because I needed to send Bobby and Jan and all them to school. Look at that. One brother up there. I don't like that. We are all the same under one law. But well, some people don't think so, you know. But anyway, let's go here. Show you, uh, child support is a service. Look at the courts. Is it under county court? Huh? Nope. Is it district court? Nope. Court of Appeals? Hell no. It ain't in the court. You know where it's at? Huh? Programs and services. Children. Wards and uh, slaves. Custody and support. There it is. Some of the programs and services, people. Child support is a program and service. I may have been telling you that for a long time, and I've been telling you that too. Look at these judges. Let me get on to the presentation. Show you how people volunteer. Your day in court. Okay, I got that. Let me break it down to you. There it is. Look. I'm going to give you the remedy. Brothers and sisters of Nebraska, I got the remedy for you. Not just me, they giving it to you. Look. A complaint. Look at that. Funk and Wagner's new Comprehension International Dictionary. It's an old dictionary I found for two dollars at the antique shop. Look at that. Old book. Complaint. What happens when you get a physical ailment? You complain to people, right? Right. I got the New Century Dictionary, two dollars. Look, cause of complaining about an ill or ailment. Complaint, complaint, complaint means to whine, people. Uh, that's all it means. To whine. Alright. Copy is provided to the custodial parent pay rent. The non custodial parent is served with a copy. With originals. The non custodial parent may file an answer to the complaint. There go one remedy. 
and then say what answer, right? And then say what you can file, right? Right. If the custodial or no custodial parent agree, a stipulated order is prepared. If the party does not agree, they want to hear and take your money. Why they don't want you? Why they want you guys to consent to their little party? This my channel is sham stop or stopping the bullshit before it starts. It's not for the weak-hearted, emotional, feely people. I'm here for brothers and sisters, and uh, to help you unvolunteer. This is educational purposes. You know, this ain't no legal advice. You know, this is the law. The court will determine the amount of child support as determined by the income of the parties in Nebraska child support guidelines, advice. Look, filing a complaint. Not a claim, people, but a complaint. I just read what your complaint was means to why and answer it now I go your remedy right here that's my proof it's voluntary I got them now custodial parent is usually given opportunity to sign a voluntary appearance and consent to jurisdiction over your body your rear, a rear, your ass of the court and avoid the cost of potential inconvenience being served in person by the sheriff. What, first person, second person, third person? Huh? The, the person served with a complaint must respond within 30 days. If the person served does not respond in writing with 30 days, the court may set the child support with the information it has. This is sometimes referred as a default order. This is easy, people. Ain't shit hard about child support. What law requires a man to pay child support? Can somebody tell me that law? I ain't talking about no statutes or no fucking codes. I ain't talking about that dumb ass shit. I know the difference between a law and a code. Important the non custodial parent must file an answer within 30 days after the service complaint. Parent serving the complaint should call you. Man, you ain't got to do shit. Handle your business, people. Don't let your business handle you. You know what I'm saying? Or go with the uh, legal facts. Go get defrauded because he over there committing fraud. He's a Ponzi scheme. You know what I'm saying? Scheduling a hearing. They take their sweet ass time. That's what that means. Take their sweet ass time. Indigent means worthless. You worthless. Look it up. Look, child support referee, look it up. Recommendation, so they can recommend a warrant once you sign it, but you also can get out of that shit. Do not bring wards. People, stop letting these people tell you how to handle your business. If you are late to schedule, to a scheduled hearing, excuse me, and your case is called, the matter may be continued to another date or even dismissed. Wow. Business. They're telling you it's a business right there. They got an EIN e number. Trust me. We do not represent you. No shit, Sherlock. Interest, banking term. Wish. I wish for you to leave me the fuck alone. According to the Nebraska Rules of Professional Conduct on Attorney's Ethics, county or authorized attorney representing the state cannot communicate direct bullshit. People, they talking about y'all when uh, you go, they go on their break, child support at lunch. They talking about y'all. So what we going to do with Johnny and them and his, his slaves? Uh, we just make them, give them, set them up, 
take like forty dollars a week. That'll be good. At least we have some income coming in. What to bring to court? Prove your case. You know how they say state your case? For people who got common sense, this is not for illiterate people because we read over here. We read over here. I have reading materials. So if you don't read and you just talk about women, all that shit, this channel ain't for you. K ass. Go. If you want to come over here and get embarrassed, fine. Do it. Be that way. So be it. You will get embarrassed. You come over here because we reads over here. No, never apply for a court appointed attorney. Apply means an application. Apply for services because it's a service, right? You got to apply for some type of service. Let me zoom in. Applying. Look. This is extortion communicating threats. Let me go. Let me go to it. Hearings, the parent who is ordered to pay child support must try to satisfy the judge that he or she is doing the best that they can pay. Wow. Stubborn and disobedient. The court will impose. So if you don't pay, that's just like a long shot. Hey, man, you ain't got my money by this week. I'm going to break your fucking leg. That's all they saying. Got to find out a woman, man or woman who issued this shit and get attacked. You know what I'm saying? Get them, get the money from them. Take their ass to court. Sue their motherfucking ass. You ain't got to put your hands on people. Take their ass to court. Under Nebraska law, all court hearings are open to the public. No shit, Sherlock. Now, go back to the back and say subpoena. Right? Chris Smith said he can get with a warrant for 685. He a motherfucking lie. I'm going to give him time to apologize to people who he fucked over. If he don't, I'm going to come out with the information how to get rid of a warrant. I'm going to debunk this nigga. Look, if the child support enforcement office asks you to appear, ask. If they got authority, why they got to ask you? Right? Court order. Look at that. That's more bullshit. Look at that. See that question? That's their question. That's a dumb person question. You know what I'm saying? I am a nugget stole your parent. What shall I do when I get the complaint? Shit, you know what I'm gonna ask him? Look, what's up with this complaint? You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go and send my answer in. Who required me to come to court? Is it required for a man to come to court? What law requires a man to come to court? How must I appear? First person, second person, third person. He who questions well learns well, people. Real talk. All these remedies they're giving y'all. Let me go on go to the next ordeal. I'm getting sleepy. This is Nebraska too. District judge ranges from 1974. Google that. Uh, Nebraska uh, bench book judicial procedures. The district range in size from one to nine counties with one to three judges for each district. The 43 court county judges are all lawyers. Bingo! As required by law. This, this is 1974 bench book I was talking about too. 
is a Nebraska Law Review. Because they do reviews, people. Child support. You didn't see not one constitutional thing in here, did you? Hell no. Because they ain't going to tell you about your rights. It ain't your they job to tell you your rights. Let's go to practitioner. As every practitioner knows all the answers are not to be found in statutes and case law. Wow. Let's go to what practitioner mean. What does practitioner mean? I'm going to go with the last one. One who uses any sly or dangerous arts. Sly. Y'all know what sly is, right? Oh, you trying to do that shit on the sly, huh? Same thing, people. Same shit. Check this out. The largely unrecorded body of law and necessary knowledge, property, procedure, tactics generally is obtainable only through the often harsh tribulations of actual experience, observation, and conversation with those possessing greater experience. All this subject to the frailties of human memory. Do y'all want to know what that means? Let me see, can I type that in? Oh, it's already there. It is already there, people. Weakness. Weakness. Fragile. To the weakness of human memory. You see what I'm saying? And uncertainties, inaccuracies, and uncertainties of human communication, and not by any means the least, the predilections of individual trial judges. Excuse me. Predilections. Excuse me. Oh man. Bingo. Looking at this. While manuals or procedure have always been written for the joint benefit of the bench and bar. Bench book is a compilation by members of the bench. Magic words. References. Follow your nose. Where no one goes. There you go, people. There you go. Magic words. What they tell you? It's word games. This is another one of my little babies in addition to my team. You know what I'm saying? Look. Christopher Smith uh, is in Virginia, I guess. I don't know where he is in New Jersey. But I got this book, Goodwill, two bucks. Well, yeah, two bucks. And 1974. Remember, people, without the old, there can't be no new. I'm going to show you one more thing, and I'm out of Look at this. Business law. I bought this at Fry's Electronics. Torch, look at that torch, baby. Torch to a corporation, assault, threat of harm, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Got all these remedies. People don't read. You don't read, man. You ain't gonna succeed. White collar crime, child support of white collar crime, people. 
I'm going to show you somebody what your employers think of you. Like Christopher Smith hiring people. That's when he calling his people. That's when he hiring them. Employer versus employee. Master-servant relationship. Wow. Independent contractor. Why he ain't preaching to y'all independent contractor? Excuse me. Why Christopher Smith ain't talking about the Constitution? Huh? Huh? Why? Why he ain't talking about the Constitution, people? He's screwing y'all. Individuals. Individuals. You know what I'm saying? He's fraud. He's a sham. You know, he's a no man. He not helping the brothers and sisters. I'm here to help. Y'all want to get some comedy on? Check this funny shit out. When a motherfucker stutter so much, he lying. And you're being charged with, or you're being, you're being, <laughs> Woo, look at this look at this nigga this is a nigga there's a lot of things out there on youtube right now man they sound like they would work you know you go in there and you open up that law dictionary and you challenge every if and it or but anything that they say you challenge it with your dictionary it man it seems like that would work but unfortunately that shit will not work Rebut. Oh, man. This is what happens when you get illiterate. You know what I'm saying? Listen to what else he say. So, if you're saying that uh, this thing worked for you in your child support and custody case, uh, or this thing worked on this tactic that they were trying to do to you, if you're saying that, my next question to you is can you prove it yeah bitch you dumb pay your child support we just prove it you know what i'm saying um if not kill yourself because you ain't a man you know what i'm saying this channel is for educational purpose only people this ain't for no talking about women i refuse to talk about women i refuse to you know what I'm saying? Because that's what they missing, they, they leaders. We as men got to come back and be their leaders because that's what we are. We leaders. And then they are uh, helpmates and they help us. And we really both leaders because one without the positive negative post, for example, a car can't go nowhere because you're going to need that woman. You know? I ain't down with the divide and conquer bullshit. Fuck that. You know what I'm saying? These dudes is... They wrongdoers. They ain't no good, you know. So, a man ain't gonna let nobody do him any kind of way. That's all I know. I know I'm not. Ain't nobody gonna tell me what the fuck I'm gonna pay with my fucking, my earnings, what I go earn, because I ain't nobody's slave. There's two people in this world. Slaves and masters. And I know I ain't no slave. So, hit me up. Anybody want some help, want some services, my energy ain't free. You know what I'm saying? It's not. I unvolunteer. You can do the same. Plenty of people unvolunteer. Next video, I'll have my one of my brothers that's, that's dear close to me around here where I met. I helped him with his uh, uh, problem. You know what I'm saying? Unvolunteer. And uh, he ain't had no problem. So, hotel.